Hey, my name is Richard and in today's video I'm going to show you how to make exit pop-ups with Thrive Architect and Lightboxes. So I'll show you how to make a landing page initially and then we'll go ahead and make a pop-up box which your visitors will see when they try and leave the landing page. You can find me at schoolofnomads.com Please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and if you want to learn how to make money online by making short tutorial videos like this one please hit the link in the description below. If you find this video useful, please hit the like and leave me a comment below. So let's jump straight over to my website and we can start creating our page. So I jumped over to my website. Here we are in the WordPress dashboard. Go to pages, just give your page a name and then launch the Thrive Architect. Once it's launched, you can either come up here and add various elements to design your page from scratch or what I prefer to do is go ahead and use one of the smart landing pages as my base and then I can adjust it from there. So I'm just going to pick this one. So here we go. The page is loaded. And what I want to do is design a pop-up box that comes on when my user tries to leave the page. So if I go ahead and hit settings and go to advanced settings, you'll see the third option down is page events. Click on page events and then I want to create an exit intent to continue. And what I want to do is, is I want to build an open Thrive light box. All the light boxes is a pop-up that comes up when your user. So we can go ahead and create a new light box. We created that light box, had other designs and for other pages, they'll be listed here. And then this option here is light box animation. There's various ways you can make the pop-up appear. You could have it zoom in. You can have it slide from the top, slide from the bottom. On this case, I'm just going to put instant. You press save and then go ahead and edit it. So press edit this light box and here you go. This is the, the pop-up page that will appear when my visitors go to leave the page. So this is very flexible. All of the images on here, all of the text, all you need to do is click on them. So you click on this image element here and on the left hand side, you see options. You can replace that image. You can size that image differently. You can change the style. There's various things you can do with that image. And then on, on the, text again you can change the color change the font so all you need to do is click on these various elements and you can go ahead and change them for the opt-in box you can go ahead and connect that to your autoresponder so uh, there are other videos i've i've made that show you this in more detail but all you need to do is click on add connection if you previously connected the apis for your various autoresponders you'll have a list of them here Click on the one you want. In this case, I'll say get response. So underneath here, you just choose your mailing list that you want the emails to go on. And then you can press apply. And then anybody that opts into this will end up on the email list of your autoresponder. If you wanted to redirect them to a custom URL, all you need to do is type in this box here, which URL you want them to go to, and then just save. And then when they opt in, they'll be redirected to the URL that you put. On the right hand side, you can add more elements to your pop-up box if you want. So there's a huge range of elements here that you can add, customize for yourself. So all you need to do is drag these across to the areas you want them to appear, and then you can start designing this. So once you've finished designing it, just press save work and then come back over to your main page, save and exit this main page. This is your page that you've designed. What you'll see is when you go to leave the page with your mouse, then the pop-up will then appear. So I hope you saw how easy that was. Um, very, very quick to, to design a pop-up box for your pages. In another video, I'll show you how to do the same thing with Thrive Leads. So thanks for watching. If you found that video useful, please leave us a like below. If you have any questions, you can find me at rich at schoolofnomads.com. And if you want to find a way to make money by making small tutorial videos like this one, please check out the link in the description.